Hello and welcome to the Farming Simulator 2013 mod review with FS Panda Mushroom. How you doing? Sorry it's been a while. Um, I've had a few problems with my computer. I lost my hard drive with all my mods on. But anyway, enough of that. Here we have for you today is a Optima 1036 irrigation system. So let's have a look in the shop for you. It's basically a sprayer. And obviously I'll show you how to use it. Um, it's in French. I do apologise, I can't read it. Basically it's the Optima 1036. Uh, it's 400 metres long the pipe when it's reeled out. I'm not quite sure what the 70M is. The di diameter of the actual pipe he's saying is 110 millimeters. Uh, it will cost you 30,000 pounds to buy. And um, also, the I've had a look in the XML. It's $10 a day maintenance. It comes in two parts in this pack. There's that, and there's a placeable, just bear with me, a placeable irrigation pipe that fills up your sprayers, and you can also use it to fill your other sprayers if you've got um, other liquid sprayers and that. So that's a placeable, I'll show you that later. Okay, here we are strange looking contraption it's got gizmos on can't really you might be able to clip through this bit because this is uh, the sort of pipe but you know it is what it is I mean it looks quite nice it's for spraying even though it says it's irrigation the easiest way is if I show you how to use it. So we get in our tractor. Because all the keys light up when it's connected to a tractor. Oh, it's not bad looking, it looks quite snazzy. Um, it works quite well so long as you don't expect too much from it right as you can see there um, you turn it on by B unfold it by X if I just press X you can see the arms lower down to stabilize it I'll just put them back up because obviously to move it you can't do it. You press numpad 2 which attaches the sprayer part to the back so you can transport it. I'll just release it and then press numpad 2 again which connects it. That's how you transport it. Right, let's go. As you can see at the moment, it is empty. So, we will go and fill it up. I found out that you can actually fill it from um, your normal fertilizer spray tank, you know, where you fill your normal fertilizer up. So you don't, if you don't want to, uh, have to fill it up with the uh, placeable, but obviously you can, because that's what it's designed for. It holds, a hun as you can see the R's come up, press R, refill it, there you go, it holds 18 litres and 
the flow rate is worked out at about 0 0.01 litre per second. What we will do is we will go and place it in this field and show you. So you should be able to, because the uh, spray lasts quite a while. Right, so we get to the edge of the field where we want to spray. Okay, we stop here. We press 2 to detach because if you do not detach, funky things will happen. I.e., your tractor will probably go into hyperspace if you try <laughs> and, uh, you know, set it up without detaching the uh, cannon. So anyway you can press your mouse and you can rotate it that way or you know you normal keys K and M to rotate it sideways. I mean you can leave it facing back if you want. Now right 9 sends it out 8 stops it so, just send out your little buddy there. Do 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 do. Yup up up. Is it far enough? Mm. As you can see, it's feeding it out. And right. You now press B to turn it on. So you can turn it on. There we go. And as you can see it's spinning round and you can also if you wish why it's on detach the tractor move the tractor away and it will still carry on but if you do it and you turn the tractor off why it's there then it will actually shut it off so we just zoom down here and you can see it's fertilizing which it does quite well. It does a fair big area and obviously you just go away do something else come back when it's finished and there you go. So that's one way for it. I will just... Right, to prove how long it is I'll just start this one up and also I will buy the placeable part so you just buy it, normal placeable find out where you are uh, doo -doo -doo. let's put it I don't know, there it'd be in the way, yeah, you know you, you have to find out the best place for it there's no maintenance, it costs you 5,500. Um, just move forward, and you can see the R there. R. It's just refilled it. Right. We just make sure it's detached. So that's attached, that's detached. Press number 9, and away we go. I'll just let it go. And I will bring this one over because it's all it's still going. And I'll show you how far We're trashy driving. <laughs> uh, what else do you expect from the panda? Sorry, cow. Whoa. Straight through it. Oh, gonna road kill. Uh, 
and we're still on reeling so this is going all the way down this field it's going a fair old chunk the pipe is there it, it will probably just find the, the straightest route and here we are the gizmo is still going You know, you get a fair... Oh, stopped. So that's a fair way. So we just get back into this. Yeah, it's emptied out. And turn it on. Obviously, it's pulling it back in. And you can just see over the horizon the spray of it. We just click back into the other tractor. And then we go. I mean, try it. Have a go with it. If it doesn't work for you, it doesn't work. But it's, um, an interesting piece of kit if you've got you know something else to do and you, you need a couple of fields fertilizing you just bang one or two down by the side of it let them go go off do something else and uh, away you go I'll be naughty I'll just flick through this I mean, it takes a fair while, you know, to... Because uh, this one... I suppose you could attach it and sort of... Whoa! Misty! Attach it and... Uh, sort of spray it away. Uh, you can attach it and sort of angle it so you get... But, there you go. Have a play. The Optina 10.36 Irrigation System This is FS Panda Mushroom Thank you for listening Take care